Boy, my palms were sweating while I was getting ready to start making this video. This is your boy BJ back from No Filter MMA, guys. Like I said in my previous video, man, we are in the era of the 125 pound division. We are, guys. I mean, you just gotta, you just gotta, whether you like it or not, you just gotta admit it. We are in the era of the 125 pound division, guys. But this fight right here, listen, Chelsea Chandler was supposed to, this is Chelsea Chandler, another fighter that Combo Breaker 99, shout out to my dude, Combo Breaker 99 pulled the wall back from over my eyes and he said, BJ, pay attention to Chelsea Chandler. You will like Chelsea Chandler. You know what I'm saying? You will like Chelsea Chandler and I'll be damned if Chelsea Chandler didn't win me over. You know what I'm saying? I like Chelsea Chandler, damn it. But I also like Macy Chasson. You know what I'm saying? So let's talk. Chelsea Chandler was scheduled to face Danielle Wolf up at 145 pounds. Chelsea Chandler has made it very clear that she wants to fight at 145 pounds. And I like that. I like that. Danielle Wolf pulls out of the fight, and now you have Chelsea, Chelsea Chandler being vocal on Twitter, and she she says. Uh, well, Macy Chasson would be a good fight for me. And I'm like, ooh, Chelsea Chandler being bold. Because let me tell you one thing about Chelsea Chandler. Chelsea Chandler, one of these hood girls who don't give a fuck. Y'all you, you know I talk about these hood girls. You know what I'm saying? Jessica Andrade. You know what I'm saying? Viviani Adarujo. You know what I'm saying? You got the, you know, Aaron, Aaron Blanchfield, Casey O'Neill. You got these hood girls, Norma Dumont. Jennifer Maya, like they don't care. You know what I'm saying? They'll fight anybody. They don't care. They don't care who you are. And Chelsea Chandler is one of these hood girls. That's my that's my that's my moniker for these girls. That's my name for these girls who just will fight any damn body. You know what I'm saying? Jillian Robertson, them hood, them Zhang Wei Li. Those are hood girls right there. You know what I'm saying? And Chelsea Chandler's like, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna put Chelsea, I'm gonna put Macy Chasson's name in my mouth. And it's exactly what she did. And Macy Chasson responds. She goes, be careful what you wish for, baby. Book it. Guys, this right here is some real 145 pound action. This right here is some real 145 pound action, guys. You know what I'm saying? Listen. Chelsea Chandler going to march forward. You know, Chelsea Chandler could break Macy if she wanted to, especially this version of Macy that we've seen, you know, it recently, this version of Macy, man, like, pfft, like these girls been, these girls been, been taking Macy out. You know, this, this 135 pound Macy, they've been taking Macy out. But of course, Chelsea Chandler is calling out to a featherweight fight. You know what I'm saying? So featherweight, Featherweight um, Macy is, is is a little bit different. Featherweight Macy defeated, as controversially as we may say, Featherweight Macy defeated Norma Dumont. <clears throat> so, you know, it is what it is. Um, but Chelsea Chandler, man, just, listen, Chelsea Chandler punches ain't the prettiest. They not the fastest. But damn it, they damn near the hardest. We missed out. We missing out on fights like, Chris Cyborg versus Norma Dumont and Chris Cyborg versus Chelsea Chandler. You know what I'm saying? Like, we missing out on those fights, guys. We missing out on those fights. But this fight right here, I am 100% bought in on this fight. Like, if if if, if Macy Chasson is down to take this fight, Sean Shelby, Mick or Dana White, y'all need to make this fight right here. This is the fight to make. Because if you want to talk about, especially if Macy Chasson showed, I'm talking about Ty Clinch, Macy Chasson. Ty Clinch, Macy Chasson shows up. We got a fight, y'all. We got a solid 145 pound fight. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I mean, Chelsea Chandler just, she, she's she coming for it all, man. You know what I'm saying? She's coming for it all. You know, and I'm just so excited to see if these two step into the cage, but I really want to see it at 145 pounds because I want to see these two at their absolute best. You know what I'm saying? I want to see Chasson at her best. I want to see Chelsea Chandler at her best. 
Chelsea Chandler says she doesn't mind fighting at 135, but she has to cut a lot <clears throat> to get to 145. You know, excuse me, to get to 135. She said, I'd rather do this at 145. Like, I've made it clear to the UFC, listen, I don't want to fight at 135. I want to fight at 145. You know what I'm saying? And Chelsea Chandler ain't missing no size. She ain't missing no skill. Nothing. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, if, if, if Macy really about that life, then I, I, I want to see it. I want to see, who, you know, I want to see this fight. You know what I'm saying? Because Macy got called out. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these girls who float back and forth between 145 and 135, you know, they want they want a piece of Chasson, man. They do. They all want a piece of Chasson. I'm just like, damn, not everybody want to beat up Macy Chasson. And now Chelsea Chandler said, I want the smoke. Give me the smoke. And I'm I'm down. I'm bought in, guys. Your boy is bought in to Chasson versus Chelsea Chandler. Listen, Chelsea Chandler breaking girls with those punches. She breaking girls with that pressure. But also, Chasson can do the same thing, too. Chasson can break you with that pressure. She can break you with those hard punches. You know what I'm saying? We hadn't really seen that, you know, that Chasson as of late, but we need to, uh, that Chasson is going to have to show up if they make this fight between her and Chelsea Chandler because if that Chasson doesn't show up, Chelsea Chandler, I'm, mark my words, if, if, if Ty Clinch Chasson doesn't show up, Chelsea Chandler will make quick work of her. She'll make quick work of her. This is your boy BJ back from No Filter MMA. Drop those comments in the comment section. Hit that like, hit that dislike, and if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Your boy is out.